Hello, it's how to not to and today I am going to be showing you how to fix a boot MGR is missing. When I turn on my PC, it comes up with this message. Boot MGR is missing. Press Ctrl or Delete to restart. But um, when I do that, it keeps coming up with the same message. So today I'm going to show you how to fix this. So the error message um, indicates that the boot sector is either damaged or missing. Um, I've tried all the tests listed here, but, um, but this didn't fix the problem. So the first thing I'm going to do is try going into the BIOS, um, just to ensure that the hard drive is set to primary boot device. So to access BIOS, click on F10, and this will take you to the BIOS setup page. Um, scroll across to system configuration and scroll down and select boot options. Um, this will take you to the boot order where you can tell the PC what you want your primary boot device to be. Um, I'm going to select this, the notebook hard drive, and then click on save. And then I'm going to reboot my PC. So as you can see, I'm still getting the same message. Um, it didn't work. So, um, but it, um, I would advise you to try that first before you go before you do anything else to ensure that it is booting from the hard drive rather than your CD, etc. And the next thing I'm going to try is to um, insert Windows 7 installation disk um, into the DVD drive. I did try to download it online. There's a um, you can go onto the Windows official site to download it online, but um, it did not um, recognize my product key, so it couldn't verify it. And in the end, I just purchased the um, installation disk for Windows 7. And here it is. So I'm just going to pop that into the PC. So I've popped the disk into the PC. It will now ask you to press um, any key to boot from your CD or DVD. So to select your language and location and click next. Right, before I install it, um, it is recommended to repair your PC. Um, th I mean, there's two ways you can repair the, the problem. Um, you can manually do it or you can automatically um, set the computer to do it for you. So I'm going to click on repair your computer and wait for the system to recover options. It's um, searching for Windows installations. Um, click next, click finish, and hopefully that should fix the problem. And the second method of uh, fixing it is by clicking on um, command prompt. What you need to type is boot rec and then leave a space forward slash uh, rebuild b c d and then press enter and that's it. And now you can restart your PC. I'm also going to plug in um, an empty external hard drive into the PC. Because my hard drive is corrupt, I'm using an external hard drive to install Windows 7 on. And now I'm going to click on install now. Setup is starting. Accept the license terms and click next. So I'm going to select custom. This is the this is because um, my hard drive is corrupt. And I'm going to search for the external hard drive along here and install Windows on it. Just going to click on this drive options. Um, oh, the format option is grayed out. Right, okay. What I forgot to do is format the external hard drive, um, and that's why it's not working. So I'm just going to format the external hard drive onto another laptop. So Windows is now booting off the external hard drive. So hopefully it should work this time. Um, looks like it's working. And Windows is starting up. Okay, we now have the Windows 7 Home Premium set up page. Uh, I'm going to select UK and just going to type a username in there. So again, accept the um, license terms and conditions and click next. Um, select recommended settings. I'm just going to select the clock, sort that out. So it's now restarting Windows. Be able to race. I don't know. We'll just have to see what the judges say when we get there. Of course she's not going to be able to. 
and we've now come to the welcome page so that's a good sign it's preparing my desktop so um, not long now so that's it um, the PC has worked um, and that's it <laughs> Um, thank you for watching. I hope you liked this video. Uh, please leave a comment down below and give it a like um, and also click on the notification button um, if you want to see more videos and thank you for watching. Bye for now. Please don't speak unless I ask you to. Oh come on. No.